Magandang araw sa inyong lahat. Nais kong magbahagi sa inyo ng kaunting kaalaman tungkol sa vision and mission ng ating universidad, ang Cavite State University. Ako nga pala si Sir Guillermo Desingaño, isang faculty member sa ating kolehiyo. Aaring uh, pamilya na kayong lahat sa mga nakapaskil na mga katagang ito sa maraming bahagi at lugar ng ating universidad at maging sa social media. Naisali na rin ito sa wikang Chabacano sa tulong ng ating mga dalubhasa mula sa Cavite City Campus. Maging sa loob ng ating mga classroom ay kalimitan din itong nakapaskil na tila humihiyaw na nagpapahiwatig ng isang importanteng mensahe. Subalit ano nga ba ang mensahe nito? Siguro ay aaminin din natin na minsan ay din natin pinagtutuunan ng pansin ang mga mensaheng ito dahil na rin sa dami ng mga bagay na ating pinagkakaabalahan. Halina kayo at ating tuklasin ang kahulugan ng vision and mission. Pangayon sa dictionary, ang vision kung noun ay nangangahulugan ng kakayanang makakakita o kaya naman ay the ability to think about or plan or plan the future with imagination or wisdom. Also, vision is the image or insight of how something could or should be in the future. Sumasang-ayon din ng mga organizational management expert na ang vision statement ay nasusulat ng mga kataga na nagsasaad ng mga adhikain para sa hinaharap o final destination samantalang ang mission statement naman ay nagsasabi kung paano makararating doon. Ang paliwanag naman ni Fred David, book author ng librong Strategic Management Concepts and Cases, a vision is what do we want to become? Nangangahulugan ito na ano ang gusto nating maging o mangyari sa ating hinaharap bilang isang kolektibong organisasyon. A mission statement is a short statement of why an organization exists, what its overall goal is, identifying the goal of its operations. Simply, it tells us what you do, how you do it, and why you do it. Ilang halimbawa, bata pa lang si Walt Disney ay pinangarap na talaga niya na magtayo ng isang park sa mga bata at tinawag niya itong Disneyland. Subalit hindi niya siya tumigil sa kanyang pangarap na makapagtayo pang muli ng isang park na higit na mas malaki at maganda. Sa kasamaang palad ay namatay siya at di nasaksihan ang tanyag na Disney World. Sa isang interview sa kanyang naulilang may bahay, Tinanong ito ng news reporter kung hindi pa siya nanghihinayang na hindi na nakita ni Walt Disney ang katuparan ng kanyang pangarap. Ang sagot ni Mrs. Lillian Marie Disney, he had seen Disney World hundred of times in his vision. Maging ang banal na kasulatan ay may nabanggit din tungkol sa kahalagahan ng pagkakaroon ng vision. Sang-ayon sa mga kawikaan o Proverbs 29.18 kung saan walang pangitain ang bayan ay sumasama. Sa English naman ay ganito ang sinasabi. Where there is no vision, people will perish. Tama nga naman kung ang mga tao na pinamumunuan ng isang leader ay walang vision ng kanyang patutunguhan ay para siyang isang taong lumalakad ng nakapiring. Kaya't mahalaga na ang mga namumuno ay magkaroon ng isang maliwanag na pananaw o vision na naaayon sa batas at katotohanan ng lubos na naiintindihan ng kanyang mga tagasunod. Noong taong 1906, isang hamak na paaralan ang itinayo sa bayan ng Indang Cavite at mga Amerikanong Tomasians ang tumayong unang guro dito. Tinawag itong Indang Intermediate School na naging Indang Farm School noong 1918. Taong 1927, ito naman ay pinangalan ng Indang Rural High School. 
Pagsapit ng taong 1958, tinawag itong Don Severino National Agriculture School. At noong 1964 ay ganap na naging isang state college sa bisa ng Republic Act 3917 at nakilala bilang Don Severino Agricultural College or DISAC. Makalipas ang halos 34 na taon sa bisa ng Republic Act 8468, DISAC was converted to Cavite State University on June 22, 1998. Pagamat walang naitala na vision statement noong mga unang bahagi, tulad ni Walt Disney, maaaring nakita na rin ng ating mga naunang pinuno sa kanilang vision kung ano ang mangyayari sa itinatag at pinamunuan nilang paaralan. Ngayon, sa ating panahon, isang vision ang ating tinatahak. Our vision is to be the premier university in historic Cavite, recognized for excellence, in the development of globally competitive and morally upright individuals. Nasa ating mga kamay ang kaganapan nito. Sa pamumuno ng ating University President Hernando D. Robles, ang vision na ito ay nasusulat na at layunin ito na tumatak sa ating mga puso at isipan sapagkat dito magsisimula ang isang lehitimong pagmamahal sa ating universidad. Ito ang ating mission. Cavite State University shall provide excellent, equitable, and relevant educational opportunities in the arts, science, and technology through quality instruction and relevant research and development activities. It shall produce professionals, skilled and morally upright individuals for global competitiveness. Mula pa noong taong 2016 hanggang 2022, inilatag na ng Cavite State University ang kanyang plano o ambisyon. Here is the 2016-2022 CVSU Strategic Plan named as Moving Forward in New Direction. Year 2016 was Transition Phase. 2017 was Transformation Phase. 2018 was institutionalization, 2019 was recognition, 2020 is a, to become a, a aim to become a global university, 2021 was sustainability, and now 2022 is year to be recognized as research university. Bago pa man magsimula ang 2020 ay naglatag muli ang Universidad ng Bagong Uh, strategic plan, lalo na dumanas tayo ng worldwide health crisis. Ito ang CVSU in the new normal and beyond. The rationale for the new normal and beyond plan strategies are the COVID-19 pandemic was disrupted, has disrupted and transformed the lives of every individual to unprecedented scales. Social, political, economic, cultural, spiritual activities have been altered. Education was not spared. Colleges and universities, public and private, were hardly affected. The pandemic created digital divide amongst the have and the have-nots. Forced employment of technology to all aspects of society or stopgap solution that aggravated the situation. Borderless education and economic globalization. Pandemic impact to political, economic, social, technological, educational, and environment aspects. Two events affected Cavite State University. Una ay ang pagsabog ng Taal Volcano noong January 2020. Ang COVID-19 pandemic na dumikha ng global health and economic crisis. A major disruption of unprecedented magnitude during modern times. Last year in 2021, the focus was sustainability. Sustained initiative in instruction, research extension, and resource generation. Maintained university standards and employment generation for graduates such as technopreneur. 
Third, faculty researchers engage in design and innovation, operationalization of Technovation Center. Fourth, more faculty members are researched as research generators and book authors. And fifth, more awards and recognition, both individual and institutional, local and abroad. The goal of CBSU, the first goal is CBSU as one of the leaders in flexible learning modalities in identified courses, program areas of competencies to be relevant in this trying time. Example is in agriculture, engineering and technology, veterinary medicine, community health services. Goal number two, CBSU as generator of new technology and innovation which is relevant, responsive and responsible. Goal number three, CBSU as enabling environment for faculty, student, researchers, and external stakeholders. Goal number four, CBSU as a resource generator to augment meager resources provided by the government for continuity and sustainability of programs and projects. And number five, CBSU as enabling environment for inclusive growth and empowerment. Ang College of Agriculture, Food, Environment, and Natural Resources or KPNR na ginawara na natataming parangal na Center of Excellence in BS Agriculture at bilang importanteng kabahagi ng strategic plan ay naglatag din ng ating sariling layon o goals. Unang layon ng kolehiyo, nilalayo ng kolehiyo na matamo ang mga sumusunod, makapaghain ng mga magsisipagtapos na may kakayanang teknikal at may tuong pangagham, hitik ng matibay na diwang pangnegosyo at nagtataglay ng matatag na kamalayang pandipunan at napapatnubayan ng positibong pagpapahalaga at mataas na pamantayang etikal. Sa wikang Ingles, the college shall endeavor to achieve the following goals. Produce technically competent and scientifically oriented graduates who are imbued with strong and repreneurial spirit, possess a strong social consciousness, and guided by positive values and high ethical standards. Malawang layo ng kolehiyo makapagsagawa ng mga kaugnay na gawaing pananaliksik at pagpapaunlad sa agrikultura at sa likas na mapagkuku ng yaman tungo sa patuloy na pagunlad ng pinaglilingkuran nito. Conduct relevant research and development activities along agriculture and natural resource management that would contribute to sustainable development in its service areas. Pangatlong layo ng kolehiyo ay makapagpatupad ng epektibong pagsasanay at abot programang nagbibigay diin sa panariling tulong, critical na pag-iisip at habang buhay na pagkatuto. Implement effective training and outreach programs that emphasize self-help, critical thinking, and lifelong learning. Pangapat na layo ng kolehiyo, makapag Makapamahala ng negosyong agrikultura, mga proyekto at mga kurnong teknolohiya na nagsusulong ng pangkabuhayan at nakabubuting pangkapaligiran dulog at pamamaraan. Manage agricultural enterprise, projects and technology incubators to promote economically viable and environment friendly approaches and techniques. And... Kalimang layo ng kolehiyo makapagtaguyod ng matatag na ugnayan sa mga organisasyong di pampamahalaan, iba pang sangay ng gobyerno at basikong sektor para sa pagtatamo ng iisang layunin. Establish strong linkages with non-governmental organizations, other governmental entities, and the basic sector for the realization of the common goal. Upang masiguro ang kalidad ng ating mga estudyante at manggagawa, we abide to CBSU quality policy. We commit to the high standards of education 
value our stakeholders, strive for continual improvement of our products and services, and uphold the university tenets of truth, excellence, and service to produce globally competitive and morally upright individuals. Binang pawakas, tayo ay kabahagi ng Cavite State University sa pagpapanday sa ating kinabukasan na malaki, sa malaki o maliit mang kapamangraanan. Si Rosa Parks, na kilala bilang Mother of Civil Rights Movement, ay nagsabi, Without a vision, the people will perish, but without courage, dreams die. Today, we face a great challenge. Maaaring maantala ang ating mga plano at layunin sa hinang nararanasan nating mga sakuna at global health crisis. Yes, we have a vision and goals, but we need courage to sustain our dreams. Maraming salamat po.